Most of us don't like a pratfall such as spilling coffee on yourself or tripping over a cable on the floor. Those clumsy mistakes may make us feel embarrassed, especially in front of other people. However, in social psychology, if you are viewed by others as a superhuman, those kinds of small mistakes will make people have more positive feelings about you, which may provide you more benefits than you previously thought. This is what the pratfall effect is talking about. This psychological effect was firstly studied by Elliot Aronson, who thought that a person who is considered as superior will become even more attractive after making some small mistakes. To prove his theory, he found 48 people and divided them into four groups, and each group has 12 people. Each group was given a different recording of a voice about how people answer some questions, just like attending an interview. The following four recordings are given to those four groups respectively. 1. People answer questions with an average level of 30% accuracy. 2. People answer questions with a superior level of 92% accuracy. 3. People answer questions with an average level of 30% accuracy and spill a cup of coffee. 4. People answer questions with a superior level of 92% accuracy and spill a cup of coffee. At the end, those groups were asked to rank the impression about those people answering the questions. The results proved what Elliot thought before the test, the people who are viewed as superior and with a pratfall of spilling coffee are found to be most likable. In comparison, the people who answer the question on an average level with a pratfall get the least positive results. Elliot believed that the cause of this effect is that a small mistake will make others better humanize those people they previously thought to be superior and thus, like them more. In other words, those superior people will be considered as a down-to-earth person and thus increase their attractiveness from others. In marketing, a famous example to use the pratfall effect is the Volkswagen Beetle campaign of the 1950s and 60s. At that moment, this car has lots of things which are not liked by the US consumers such as being small, ugly, and being made by Germans. However, its marketing campaign used the line, ugly is only skin deep, to admit the car was ugly which is also used to convince consumers of the engineering excellence of the car. Another example is from the Listerine mouthwash product. It used the advertisement, the taste you hate, twice a day to admit the bitterness of their products which indicate a sign of the mouthwash's effectiveness. In summary, some flaws of products might not be a bad thing. You can use the pratfall effect to design a campaign to convert the weakness into strength. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button or subscribe button for more interesting topics.